hi, I'm Sue Wilkins, Director of Mass Vaccination, Flu and Testing for University Hospitals Plymouth. It's a really exciting day to be talking to you today. So I think we've had some very interesting information published within the last few days around the success of the vaccination programme. So um, Tim Spector, who is a leading epidemiologist and supported by the Department of Health, has provided some very interesting statistics that shows that for those that have had one vaccine, your chance of getting COVID has reduced from a baseline figure of someone who's had no vaccination of one in 2,500 based on the number of people with COVID at this time to one in 8,000. And that's just after one single vaccine. In addition, for those that have completed the course, so people who've had two vaccines, your chance of now getting COVID is about one in 40,000, which I hope shows quite how well the vaccination program is going. And when we talk about vaccination, we're in a really good position now that we've opened up the option for people to be vaccinated if they're age 45 and over. And it won't be long until we move into the age 40 to 45 age group. So please watch out for that letter coming through your door and the details of how to book. So Home Park is the large scale vaccination centre for this side of the county based in Plymouth, um, but its reach is much further than Plymouth itself. And we'd encourage anyone who has received that letter to go online or call 119 and book their appointment. This Thursday in particular, open until 10 o'clock. And um, there are many, many appointments available, particularly between 7 and 10 for those that have received the letter and for some reason have not booked so far. So it's not your own the opportunity but I would positively encourage people to come along this week and grab those appointments before we open up to the next age group which will be the 40 to 45 year olds very soon so hopefully we can um, enable everyone who's in the previously invited uh, groups particularly this 45 to 50 age group to come along and get their first vaccines before we progress further.